So this package arrived for me just the other day. And I'm going to do an opening now for you of it. Um, we're going to take a look at what is inside. An interesting size. An interesting size. Or is it? Am I just saying that? But let's take a look. So yeah, so this one, what a nightmare. What a nightmare this one was getting. It seriously was. So I was on eBay. I was on eBay and I was just happened to be sort of perusing, perusing along. And I came across this and it cost me £16. And for £16, um, it would come and join the collection most definitely. Um, I'm going to open it up now and you will see what it is. And uh, yeah, if you know these, you know they're a good price for 16 quid. Oh, a nightmare on Elm Street. So you can see why I said it was a nightmare. So, let's get rid of that box. So this here is a nightmare on Elm Street Necker Freddy Krueger figure. Nightmare on Elm Street as you can see there um, and it was well 16 pounds something I paid for this neck of figures are usually up in the 40s um, so for 16 pound I wasn't going to turn it down um, nice image there so as you can see there's Freddy Krueger there himself let's see if we can get this a bit closer I'm just moving that out of the way so as you can see there, he's got an additional head. He's got the hands where he has the syringes on the end. Um, he's got his hat there. He's got the little puppet version of himself, if you remember that dream sequence. Then we have the house down there, the little doll's house. And also we have the chest. Yes, the chest with all the, the souls that he's taken which is there as you can see that you can place on him to give the appearance of that scene as well so yeah so so nice nice figure packaged nicely i'm not going to undo it i don't i don't take my figures out they're boxes um i've got a few necker figures i have um now i'll be honest i used to have a freddy krueger um movie maniacs figure movie maniacs back in the day um, some probably in the 90s and it was made by McFarlane Toys before NECA took over these sort of horror characters these horror icons and I sold it I sold it a few years ago three four years ago I, I got rid of rid of that figure as well as wealth of others that I had so um, it's kind of like a nice replacement to that um, yeah so there we go there we go now I know a little while ago I'd done a video and it was about being a slave to collecting and this sort of stuff. And um, I think for a little while, I mean, I've got a couple of Blu-rays due this month, but I think I'm going to try and calm it down on the pickups. Seriously. Um, see how we progress with that one. Um, but there we go. Anyway, so that's that video done and dusted. Let me know in the comments your thoughts and I shall see you all on the next one. Take care all and goodbye.